What's up, everyone? Welcome to the Power Play with CJ. Today we're focusing on uh, Olimata missing the rest of the season after re-injuring his shoulder uh, last month. And, um, you know, he had shoulder surgery at the end of last season. And, uh, you know, it's just been um, only played in 20 games this season as a 20-year-old after having a fantastic rookie year as a teenage defenseman in the NHL. Um, you know, really able to do some great things and, uh, you know, play at a high level and, and, and compete and play hard, um, you know, every night for the, the Penguins. Um, you know, having the, the tumor scare and, you know, he's been able to overcome a lot this year. But, you know, he's been, um, he's kind of an injury prone, you know, to, to put it bluntly. So, I think it's definitely a tough blow for the Penguins. Uh, you know, he's been such an integral part of that, that blue line. And, you know, now the, the onus is on the front office, you know, uh, to go out there and, and acquire someone that can fill the, the void in those minutes. You know, I just think, you look at how well he played last year as a rookie, you, you know, you got to expect some sort of a uh, sophomore slump. But, you know, I thought he was pretty good this season, you know, with the exception of the injuries. So, um, you know, I think it's it's time for the the Penguins to, you know, let, allow him to get surgery, allow him to miss the rest of the season because, you know, long-term health is most important. But, you know, now there's a void there. Um, you know, the pool has been playing up pretty well for them as of late since he's been up. And I think he's still leading the uh, AHL team looks very scoring. And, though, and yeah, I think he's been down there since uh, Mata got hurt. So that's pretty interesting. Um, but, you know, that's... Oh, the pool just got sent down. So that's... That kind of rules that one out. Um, but, you know, you just got to, um, you know, roll with the punches with this stuff. You know, I think great teams are going to go to reverse you over the course of the season. There's going to be injuries that come up. Um, how they respond to those injuries is what separates great teams from, from good teams. And Pittsburgh's playing some amazing hockey. And they've been able to do it without um, Mata for, what, about half the season? So it's like, all right. You know, you got to keep piecing it together. But, uh, you know, I think Jimmy Rutherford can go out there and make a move. You're obviously not going to replace him, you know, per se. But, you know, you can find someone to fill that void and, uh, you know, help the team going forward. You know, eight points, you know, nine points, 20 games doesn't jump off the page at you. But you factor in, you know, the amount of minutes he's able to play and the fact that he plays well beyond his years. And last year's rookie had 29 points in 78 games. It was one of Finland's best players at the Olympics in a, a bronze medal winning effort. You know, you got to look at um, look at the whole thing with uh, with Mata. So we'll uh, we'll see what happens. Anyway, that's our episode of the Power Play with CJ on the Penguins losing Olimata for the season. Stay tuned for episodes of the season and beyond. Later, guys.